My name is Narinda Duga. I live in Mississauga, Ward 5. I've been supporting uh, Bonnie Crombie since uh, she was elected as MP with the Liberals. And then last uh, time she ran as mayor uh, after she was councillor in my ward. Uh, I supported her then. And now uh, with the second term, uh, we're going to be supporting her again. And I encourage every Mississaugians to support her so that she can become stronger and she will be the voice uh, for Mississauga. She has brought a lot of businesses. She has gone overseas uh, like Brazil and India to brought the businesses here. Um, so we're going to be supporting her and I'm asking all Mississauga residences to go and support her. Thank you very much. Hi, we're here at uh, our Mayor Bonnie Crombie's campaign office. Uh, you can see the excitement. We're really, really excited. And uh, I'm just going to urge everybody to make sure you go out on October 22nd and vote for an awesome mayor who has done co and co uh, so much for our city, uh, bringing so many jobs and investments in Mississauga of uh, almost more than 20 million in the last four years. And uh, we're really, really proud of all the great work she's been doing. And uh, she's been very supportive supportive towards all the communities here and uh, we're excited for our uh, to be a part of team bonnie and we wish her all the best thank you aap log dekh rahe hain z9 tv media aur aaj hum ek special special interview kar rahe hain mayor bonnie crombie ka for reelection unhone jo bahut sare kaam kiye community ke liye and uh, from day one she has uh, got this office she's been working hard for city of mississauga and it's just not the talk because she has shown by the action what she has done uh, madam Again, once again, welcome to Z9 Media. You have done a great job for City of Mississauga. The passion you have, it, the energy you have, it. People will see the speech you just did on the chair. That shows the uh, the passion and the power. So please, I want you to again uh, say a few words about what you have done in the jobs. Like a lot of jobs you brought to Mississauga, companies you brought to Mississauga. So I want from you to straight to the audience, to the to the voters of Mississauga and across uh, Mississauga to know what Madam Mayor has delivered in the last four years and how much passion she has to do more for. The Thank you so much. So thank you to Z9 for coming out today for the interview. We've done so much. We have a very strong track record in Mississauga over the last four years, keeping our city affordable, finding savings for our residents, investing in transit, 46,000 hours, more hours in our transit last year, uh, building our bus rapid transit system, starting to build our light rapid transit system, bringing growth, development, 250 acres on the waterfront, uh, keeping our community safe. But the thing I'm most proud of is the job. So we have brought over 11,500 jobs, adding $20 million to the business tax base, uh, and almost 450 companies in the four years. It has been one of my biggest priorities. Cognizant, for instance, I had to compete for them. They wanted to be on the innovation corridor. Uh, I had to compete against Waterloo and Toronto, and we won them, and that's 2,000 jobs. Uh, Bombardier decided to move to Mississauga, another 2,000 jobs. The largest pharmaceutical company in Brazil was going to go to New Jersey until they met me, right? And of course, so they we won that investment as well. BioLab invested $56 million in Mississauga. Of course, Wayfair. Everyone knows Wayfair from Facebook. They're always advertising their homewares. They chose Mississauga for their head office, their Canadian operations. Campbell Soup, when they left Etobicoke, they chose Mississauga. When I went to Japan, I, I thanked all the CEOs for their business. I asked them, do anyone in your supply chain might be interested in moving closer to you in Mississauga and we identified Tomei so they came to Mississauga and and then last week we had a big investment um, CBS Studios as oh, they're, coming to they're coming to Mississauga 400 jobs six studios uh, it's a huge achievement and I'm very very proud we had to pitch for that one as well so I'm very proud of my economic development office and all the work myself my staff do in working with the CEOs pitching our city telling them why it's important that they invest in Mississauga giving them what we call our value proposition why we are the best place to invest to live to work to invest and to raise their families and so this is very I'm very very proud of these achievements 
Well, Madam Mayor, in five minutes, you have said very strong words, and the message is for your work. And there's a lot of work, the jobs, the companies, and all that. And I think there is no stop to it because when after your election, you're going to go back to those things and doing it. Now, what else are you doing it for uh, for the sports? And we got a lot of people wants to know in our community that how are you working towards this uh, cricket becoming oh, such a big yeah. favor, fe uh, fever to it? Sure. So absolutely. So first of all, let me say that we have seven cricket pitches in Mississauga, and that's more than the city of Toronto. So we're very proud of that. We have a sports tourism strategy, bringing sporting events here, such as like the Pan Am games and, and hockey tournaments and all these sort of sports related uh, um strategies to bring in more competitions here. Uh, but lately we've now rebranded our biggest venue where we have hockey called the Paramount Center, PFF, Paramount, Fi Paramount Fine Food Center, right? But because we know, uh, oh, we now have three competitive sport teams. We have the Steelheads, OHL, we have the Raptors 905, and now we have a soccer team, indoor, indoor soccer, uh, called the Mississauga Metro Stars. And they're the first, the first league, the first team in Canada for this, for this league, which is growing like crazy in the United States. And I think you're very interested in this. We're doing a feasibility study for a soccer slash cricket arena. Wow, so, yeah, so we're looking to see if we, we so if we could build one here. That it would be a soccer arena, multi-purpose arena yeah, exactly. for soccer, for and cricket, etc. For, yeah. yeah, for, for competitive for sure, competitive sure. functions. Yeah. So we're doing the feasibility study now on where this could go and how we could fund it. You know, we're hoping that ahead of FIFA 2026, yeah. maybe the federal government will make some money available for more uh, do, do for more that, yeah. soccer stadiums. So we hope we'd like to cash in on some of that as well. So lots going on in Mississauga. So you have heard that, uh, Madam Mayor, even what, 20 days, oh, 15 days left uh, before the re-election and we all know that what she has done and I think we can see her for the next, not just four years, <laughs> four years times four, then three and four. Well, you have done a great job here and uh, people loved it and that's what we need, a passionate, a person who can fight for the rights, for the municipality through federal and provincial. Thank, uh, thank you very much, Madam Mayor. You want to say before? Yeah, so just uh, thank you all for your support. The important thing on October 22nd is to get out and vote. You know, for whatever reason, yeah. in municipal politics, the voter turnout is lower than in federal, provincial, but we're the level of government that works with the people. We can make change quickly, and we can impact your lives very positively. So October 22nd, or in the advance polls, every weekend there are advance polls, this weekend, next weekend, and then big election day on October 22nd. Please bring your family, your friends and your neighbors, but come out and vote. By October ko election ke liye aap sab nikalna hai votes ke liye aaj I think since today the advance polling has already started right so uh, the advance polling has started again jo jo hamara channel dekh rahe hain so ka the message dekh rahe hain election mein vote dekar hi hum apne aap ko ye sabit kar sakte hain the community is working hard for the elections for the community aapne vote dena hai make sure ke aaj se leke October तक अपने friends को, families को through Facebook, through calls and as you always say, every person who's watching right now bring the five people to vote. Am I right? That's right. Absolutely. That's a good calculation. That's what we'll do. So let's do that and inshallah we will see 22nd evening we will have the same talk with the mayor about after her winning. Oh, let's not tempt the fates. But <laughs> <laughs> thank you, ma'am. Thank you very so much. much. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you.